This is probably the craziest Frostalian note you'll ever make. If you don't want to waste your time, here's a notepad of all the information you need. If you want to watch it more in depth, then here's how you do it. You are basically making a Frostalian Noct with Ferocious, Musclehead, Legend, and Lord of the Underworld. How do you get those? Ferocious and Musclehead can drop from literally anything. So you just have to slip them in any time you need. But Legend comes from level 50 pals however we don't want any level 50 pal because we have lord of the underworld which comes from specifically necromus so you will need to capture at least one necromus now in order to make frostalian noct we need a frostalian and a hell zephyr meaning you will eventually need a hell zephyr with legend and lord of the underworld and where do we get both Necromus. How do we get Hellzephyr from Necromus? There are many options, but I went for Mamorist Crest just because this one has no passive skills, so it's easier to pass down both skills from Necromus. And yeah, you get the Hellzephyr with Legend and Lord of the Underworld, and then you mate it with a Frostalian, which will probably have Musclehead and Ferocious. You don't have a Frostalian with Musclehead and Ferocious, then you can try and make a Frostalian Noct using Hillzephyr as the source of Musclehead and Ferocious and mate it with just any Frostalian. And then you get this Frostalian Noct and another Frostalian Noct with Legend and Lord of the Underworld. And yeah, you basically make this absolute monster with 2800 damage of course because it's buffed by who crates and now that i look at them they're not even level 50 so this might not even be the final form and yeah that's uh, that's about it that's how you make the absolute perfect postalian noct and by the way i'm not gonna ignore the lucky way instead of lord of the underworld if you want a postalian noct that is basically good at all the elements then maybe you want Lucky instead of Lord of the Underworld. But I prefer the 20% damage of Lord of the Underworld for all dark attacks instead of just 15% of Lucky. However, for Cataris, stay tuned for the next video because I have made the perfect Cataris. So yeah, that's about it.